why should you become a guest on a podcast or why should you even do podcasts, right? Uh, that's what I wanted to talk about today. My name is Jay Vix. I own a digital marketing agency called JVI Mobile Marketing, where we educate small business owners on digital marketing in their business, how to use digital and online marketing to grow your business. And one of the ways that we help small business owners grow is we have a podcast called Meet the Experts. And it's focused on letting small business owners tell their story, getting the story out into the world, right? A lot of people that we talk to say, oh, when they first come to us, oh, I just I just want to get my name out there better. I want my name. My, I got to get my name out there. Or no, out there is like this mythical place that means the marketplace, right? Or the world or their local community. Well, one really great way to be seen by your local community is to, is to be on podcasts because you're often seen as an expert when you do that. So I was doing a little bit of digging and there's a couple of reasons why being on a podcast is a really great idea. One the amount of shares and tweets and and backlinks and traffic you can get is is huge. Uh, one thing people don't often look at when they do an episode of a podcast, they should also try to get reviews to their Google My Business or Google listings that say, oh, I heard this company on this podcast and they were great, right? Getting reviews for, for being on a podcast is good. But really the big key, and I read this on an article today, people often think, oh, if I go on a podcast, I can get more sales, right? That's true. You can, your job of being on a podcast is to ultimately get you more leads, right? However, when you're on the podcast, the last thing you want to do is give a sales pitch, right? You shouldn't sell during your interview. So if you go on a podcast as an expert, like our podcast, which is called, appropriately enough, Meet the Experts, right? Your job is to share your story. One of our hashtags that we have adopted as part of our company culture is to tell your story, right? Tell your story, share your story, right? So if you can share your story, and at the same time, educate others about your industry and why people need this industry, right? Then you can do a really great job of driving those leads and getting people to contact you. Make sure the person who's doing the interview is also sharing your episode. We share all of our episodes, right? We share them, we stream them out live, uh, and then we share them afterwards. And we even have a couple of options to run them on Spotify and, and the different podcast platforms. We also have an option where we can share it to all of your social channels as well as put some money into the boosting of that episode to your target market, right? So if you want to grow your business in 2022, I strongly suggest you look at podcasting as an option, not, not running a podcast yourself, but being a guest on as many podcasts as you can. And there are some really hyper local podcasts. I know there's a one for the triad here in Greensboro, where I'm at, there's a, a group of, uh, of podcasters, uh, but there are also very industry specific podcasts. There's millions of them out there. So there are podcasts for you to get on. I suggest you do it. But the first one I hope you would go on is our podcast, Meet the Experts. And I will put a link here below this video if you want to apply, it's free, uh, but you can just go through a quick quick onboarding and uh, hopefully we'll see you as a guest on Meet the Experts. Talk to you soon. Take care.